So let me go ahead and complete just a couple columns on this vertical formulas practice. So we have the five basic most standard formulas in Excel that we're going to do. We're going to do the sum in yellow, average in orange, light blue will be min, then max, and finally count. So I'm going to go ahead and highlight all of those because I know I'm going to do it. Notice here, write them and you will learn a lot. So that's why I stair step these so that I make you write out the formulas. I don't want you using that easy button either. Notice what happens if I come up here, go to auto sum and sum this up. Do you see how it stops at that blank cell? Well, I happen to know that I want to go ahead and do the entire range. So make sure you do the entire range. I'm going to now do it the way I suggest. So this is going to be equals average. And I want to make sure I hit the entire range, which looks to be A3 through A40. Now, I can save a little bit of time because this range is never going to change for the rest of the formulas in this column. So here in blue, it looks like I wanted the min, so I'm going to say equals min, hit control V for paste. A little bit hard to see, but it's pasting that range. Come up here, equals max, paste that range. Here, equals count, paste that range. And there we go. Now, if you notice as I double click, I get a graphical representation and I can audit my work. So this one's already done for me. Let me make sure the range is correct. Notice it goes through the empty cell. So I'm going to go ahead and grab that range. Control C, copy that into my clipboard. Come down here, say equals average. Control V. This was min, right? Yep. Control V. This was max, and this was count. So I'm typing them in. I'll go ahead and audit that last one, make sure it's doing the correct range. It is. Now I can go ahead and complete the rest. Notice here, I could just complete this one and fill the formulas, complete this one column, and then fill the formulas over once I fill in the answers. So this really doesn't take long, but I want you to practice it. That's why I do this stair step, and I really hope it helps. Take care.